Welcome back. Our personal finance reporter, Stephanie Asimkos, is here to break down why senior citizens are seeing some of the biggest Social Security payments in decades. Hi, Stephanie. What's happening here? So this is a really big deal, Kristen, and beneficiaries could see their monthly benefits increase by as much as $80 per month beginning next January. And this is according to a Bank of America note that was released this week. So this is actually the biggest boost since about 1983 that beneficiaries will see. And at the beginning of this year, there was only about a 1.3% increase to the cost of living adjustment. And that's translated to roughly about 20 bucks extra a month. And that hasn't been enough for people to sort of keep pace with this year's 5% inflation spike. And we've all kind of noticed this, you know, things like cars, travel, laundry machines, um, certain grocery staples like fruit and milk, all of those things are more expensive now. And Social Security was designed to safeguard against this inflation. So beneficiaries who are generally on fixed incomes they still have, you know, their benefits still provide them spending power to buy things. So that, that cost of adjustment is, is really huge and one way to ensure that seniors and disabled Americans have meaningful income. So with all of that extra money uh, in the pockets of the senior citizens and, and those with disabilities, what does this mean for the economy right now? Right. So analysts are really looking at this new boost to really boost the economy for next year. So inflation is expected to fall next year. But with COLA, that cost of living adjustment going up, that calculates to about an $80 billion or so swing in net tax benefits. So it's a great thing for people whose budgets are being squeezed right now because financial relief is on the way, and a good thing for beneficiaries who will just have more to spend, feel a little bit more financially comfortable, and then boost that economy. I also want to ask, when can some of those beneficiaries really start to expect to see some of that extra money? Great question. So nothing is official yet. These are just analyst estimates. Um, but the Social Security Administration still has about three more months to collect data before it renders its official decision. Um, that'll usually come in October. And then once that official determination is made, the updated amount will roll out starting in January. So maybe a couple, maybe say six more months before um, more money in those monthly benefit checks. Yeah, still a, a good amount of time to go before we can see folks getting some of those larger and much needed larger paychecks from their Social Security. Stephanie Asimkos, thanks so much for giving us all of those details. Her article will be on the site, yahoofinance.com, if you want to read it and take a look, perhaps, at some of the benefits that you might be receiving in the next couple of months.